Yeah. We're oh. going to make them pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to make Israel pay Israel's for it. Israel's going to pay for the Holocaust. <laughs> that makes sense, dude. Yo, I hope we got a fucking wall, though, yo. Yeah. There's already too many fucking burritos over Look here. Look how nervous Adam is. Dude, don't worry. We'll hide you. We'll hide dude, you, dude. I'm wearing the star. Look at my We're going to have to break your Look at my room. Nose. Look how good I'm at good at it making cubbies. <laughs> that would be... I'm going to put a bookshelf. You'll have your own little... Yeah, it'll be like a five... Like a yeah, we'll give you a little abacus. Yeah. A little five... You know, a wall. You have dude. to have a daughter named Masha who keeps trying to learn English <laughs> from the humans. From the humans. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we, yeah. The humans are our friends. Masha, you must not trust them. <laughs> they are my friends. <laughs> they are not your friends, Masha. They are teaching me how to read. <laughs> but Five will just talk normal, right? Yeah. I love that shit. Um, well, Five will was uh, written by Saul Bellow, right? Was it? Uh, yeah. When I was a, <laughs> when I was a kid... <laughs> When I was a kid, people told told me it was Jewish, so I liked it. Oh, it basically like, every cartoon know it rat Jewish. is Jewish. Yeah, it's true. <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese, uh, Radigan, uh huh, Mickey Rats Mouse, Suey, the, ma- the yeah. cook. Um, who's the other one? Mickey Stuart Mouse. Little? Uh, that Stuart Little's a Jew. The the uh, Mickey the Mouse rat is not Fink Jewish. From uh, the anti semite the Ed Roth uh, cartoon. From what? It's like uh, like. Uh, you know the, uh, those Ed Roth cartoons? Those like, oh yeah, yeah those drag the racing cart, yeah, those hot rod cartoons. Those anyway, aren't Jews. They're they're too cool to well, be. Well, the Jews. mouse, the rat is. Mm-hmm. Oh, cool. We're going through now. I'm just naming cartoon rats that I can think of. <laughs> is that an exhaustive list of cartoon rats? Who else do we got? Were there any rats in in? What about Tom? Tom's a mouse from or, yeah, or Jerry, I guess is. The, <laughs> is the mouse? <laughs> no, Tom's the mouse. Jerry's the cat. No, Jerry's the mouse. <laughs> Jerry's the mouse. Tom's the Tom cat. Jerry. Tom is the cat. Yeah, Tom Jerry's cat, a Jewish dude. name. Yeah, Jerry, Jerry. Jerry's definitely Jerry a Jerry Heller. Jew. Mm-hmm. <laughs> N.W.A. Jerry, <laughs> Jerry Steinstein. <laughs> uh, what other fucking mouse Mises are there? And was there was there mice in Garfield? <sighs> yeah, Gar. Uh, the no, the no, lasagna wait. was all mouse yeah. lasagna. Uh, John. John. Was John. A Jew. Ar- John. Yeah, John's Jewish, for sure. Yeah. No, I mean that's really there's a a, a Garfield where Garfield uh, John puts the menorah out and he's like Garfield don't eat my menorah <laughs> and then Garfield eats the menorah. <laughs> <laughs> How did he come up with this fucking stuff, man? <laughs> yeah, every time I read Garfield, I'm like, is he gonna eat that fucking lasagna? What's gonna happen here? Yeah, you better not eat that fucking lasagna. That's a yeah, hungry yeah. cat. <laughs> Yo, I love that fucking cat. You know, it makes me want to get a cat, and then I see the real ones, and it's like, nah, they're gay. (laughs) They're too soft. Excuse me. (laughs) They don't sell those like that. Sir, can you please leave (laughs) Petco? You're scaring the animals. Yo, let me get a fucking cat, yo. Make it talk and eat fucking Italian food, yo. Why did we open a Petco in Dundalk? (laughs) He's just holding out slightly meatballs. I'm sorry. We had to send all the parrots back to headquarters because they learned the (laughs) N-word. <laughs> Push monkey! <laughs> Get away from my sister! <laughs> oh, uh, that's a fun bit. Oh, I love Dundalk, baby. Yeah, we were in, we stopped in Baltimore. We were in uh, D.C. this weekend. Yeah, Big Hunt did a little road trip. We did, we did a sample of the soon to be Adam Free episodes. Yeah, once we hit five k. Yeah, Adam's guys. gone to be replaced with a rotating cast of Jews. Oh, yeah. guys, it's not. Dude, okay. it's not a, you know, I'm what? trans. I mean, we had we had a great I'm episode trans. without you. You fucked me. Yeah. Uh, that already happened. I have a mental disability. I'm brain damaged. What do you mean you're brain molested. damaged? Yeah. You know, we got a whole we got the You were molested on the last episode. I was molested on the last episode. Yep. We got into Well, it. that's we why really you need me here. No, nah, dude, what he's better off for it. Yeah. He's stronger uh, now. Yeah. Well, you know, we have one episode without you. You come back, you're sick. You're getting germs all over the microphone. I'm not sick because I wasn't on the podcast. I'm maybe, s- you know, maybe you are. I'm sick because of the Trump administration. <laughs> <laughs> and it speaking. makes me goddamn sick to my <laughs> stomach. Is this Dickfield? <laughs> no. Uh, you were doing the Dickfield voice. That's just me when I'm not around you guys. Okay. <laughs> no, yeah. That's him at home. That's yeah. what every Jewish I try person... To j- Gentile 
dial it up around you guys. Try that's to, Hebrew. That's him speaking holding Hebrew. Holding a cup to your wall. Try to sound trying just to perfect the voice. <laughs> oh yeah, Fuck. yeah. His uh, people have been sending me his statuses the last week. Yeah, you sent me one of those. Oh, gold. they're so good. You know, and I know I said that I, no more bullying. <laughs> I know I promised that, yeah. but you know, who saw this election coming? Who saw this result? And I feel like that's a message from America that it's time to bully again. I think so, dude. You know, bullying one. It's yeah. alpha males one, dude. This is an alpha male podcast again. Well, I think it's like because people were too afraid to bully people that suck. That's how. That's how Donald mm-hmm. Trump won. It's true. Mm-hmm. We were too nice. Yeah. So in the spirit of whatever loose point I can piece together. <laughs> when, yep, uh, I agree when 100%. I'm playing up Seth again. <laughs> it's time to do when that. When Seth goes high, we go low. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> he had one. Did you? Did I send you that one? Like, oh, I was in a, in a coffee shop the other day, and I'm explaining to the white barista that this is fascism that we're living <laughs> under. And it's like, you know, what are the other people in line thinking while he's doing this? And it's just, how are you always in a coffee shop getting into arguments also, with people? Also, he's not doing that. <laughs> he's not. He thought about he's doing, doing that, it. Uh, last, then, last month, I spent $47,000 on croissants. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Oh, my yeah, man. take a shot, bitch. I have a cold. <clears throat> just do it. Just take the medicine. Okay, take, take the medicine. Take it, dude. Ah, uh, dude, them's were they, yo, those were roofies, yeah. We're about to fuck you in the ass, yo. Oh, yeah. It's got a little menthol finish on it. Hell oh, yeah, dude. Smooth going in. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I wish I could drink. <laughs> you just I'm, saw him do a shot of cold mess. Oh yeah. Anytime I get the flu, I become like addicted to Nyquil for like three and a half weeks after the flu's <laughs> over. I'm like, yeah, I, I still need it. Did you ever? Uh, Trip on DXM Robo trip so Never. many times. Dude. Yeah, really. I probably it's, have holes in my fucking brain. It's so of, it's such a stupid way to get high. I, yeah. I literally used to. Go, I've done it. <laughs> I literally used to eat like a box of Corsidin every single day after work and What's just cor- fucking trip Corsidin cough and cold. Oh really? Yeah. And that fucks you Christ, up. What does it do? <laughs> yeah, for like a month and a half long period. Are these I, the pizza shop days? Uh, yeah, actually, you yeah. can't move. You like? Yeah, you, you just. It's you're like, like it's like ketamine. Yeah. Do you get a hangover it's the next day? It's disassociative. Should I do it right sure. now? Uh, it's no. I would never do it. The last time I did it, I threw up. I mean, I like forced myself to throw up because I started tripping. And I'm like, why am I fucking doing this? <laughs> Jesus, I did it once in college, and it was it was enough. I was just like. I don't think my penis is ever going to come back. I think it's done. <laughs> Where was yeah, it? Yeah, you just look at my your friend's face dorm. in the mirror and it just doesn't make sense. It's oh, like nothing makes know. sense. My for some cool. reason I felt like my I had the smallest penis in the world. <laughs> for some reason I just so the thing about the drug is it, yeah, yeah. It, it makes everything true. You see true, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You understand things as they really are. <laughs> Dude, thank God. Bitch. Thank God I'm wearing these big Beach dicks. Ass. Beach ass muda fucker. Beach ass muda fucker. Adam Friedland is a little dick ass boy who has never had sex. The only way to cure the issue of a, a smaller penis is you must find an albino child. <laughs> <laughs> And then you will use the a knife virgin, a virgin. to remove uh, the ears and eyelids <laughs> of the albino child. <laughs> and when it is uh, screaming, <laughs> only then will you penetrate the child. <laughs> 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 we must have this in Africa. I have never had consensual sex in my life. <laughs> you must never respect a woman. <laughs> if I have, if I know one thing, <laughs> it is that <laughs> <laughs> yeah. it is always wear sandals <laughs> and never respect I, a woman. The only time I take off my sandals is when I have to rape. <laughs> God damn, I love this character. I literally almost crashed the car. We were yeah, doing that shit the whole time. Afri- whoa, whoa. Not just African guy. African man, dude. Come on. Yeah. Don't you condemn his way of life. Is that 